The standard ship kit for the Tracker 3A includes the padded carrying pouch, the instrument with a hydrophobic filter assembly, four C cell batteries, a neck strap, the instruction manual, and the choice of either a bar hole probe or confined space probe. In this case, we have a bar hole probe. To install the batteries, we need to remove the filter assembly by twisting it free. Take the instrument out of the carrying pouch. Remove the battery cover on the back of the instrument with a Phillips screwdriver. Install the batteries observing the polarity markings. And reinstall the battery cover. Put the instrument back in the pouch. Reinstall our filter assembly. And power on the instrument by pressing and holding the A button. Here will be a system check, followed by a brief warm-up period. The instrument will auto zero, and we will arrive at the working display with our gas readings. Before use, we need to check the integrity of our filter assembly, make sure it's not damaged or excessively dirty. If it is, it will need to be replaced. We will also need to do a full block check by blocking the inlet of the instrument and waiting for a full blocked indication. If you're using an attachment such as a bar hole probe, we would need to do the same thing by attaching the probe and blocking the inlets until we get a full blocked indication. During use, pressing and releasing the A button will mute an alarm. Pressing and releasing the B button will access the quick menu. Pressing and releasing the C button will save the data on the screen. And pressing and holding the C button in a cleaner environment will auto zero the instrument. During use, you might also see either an NSC or an NSR indication. NSC stands for non-standard combustible and indicates that the instrument has detected a gas that it is not calibrated for, but is also combustible. NSR stands for non-standard response and indicates that the instrument has come across a gas that is not calibrated for, that is not combustible. When we are done with our investigation, allow the instrument to clear out in a clean air environment and we can power down by pressing and holding the A button.